Hello, tonight I'm going to be making the, or tonight I'm going to be making the uh, best homemade ice cream that we've ever had. Uh, it's going to take 32 large egg yolks. It's going to take uh, 4 cups of heavy cream. It takes 12 cups of half and half and 4 and a half cups of sugar. First thing we're going to do is we're going to put in all the cream. And we're going to put in all the heavy whipping cream and half and half together. We're going to bring it to a simmer and stir. And uh, when I get this done, I'll be right back. Okay, well, I'm at uh, that's 30, 31 eggs. I always, uh, always, even with store-bought eggs, put my, uh, crack my eggs open to a different bowl. So you never know what you're going to find inside. It's the only fresh egg that we have. Our chickens aren't laying very many right now. And 32. Next step is to beat them, whisk them till a till they change color. Until they lighten in color. So let's go ahead and whisk them till they turn lighten in color. And we'll come back when I get this done. I'll okay. Well, I think it's lighter in color, but I can't really tell. My wife's the whisper, not me. So I'm going to go ahead and add the four cups of four and a half cups of sugar. I'm going to go ahead and do it in stages here. There's four, and we need a half. Good. Oh, Okay, and next step, uh, I'll be back with you here in a second. Okay, the next step is to temper the cream mixture into the eggs and sugar by gradually adding small amounts until about one third of the cream mixture has been added. Pour the remainder and return 
the entire mixture to the saucepan and place over low heat. Cook, continue to cook, stirring frequently until the mixture thickens slightly and coats the back of the spoon and reaches 170 to 175 degrees Fahrenheit. And this part will just uh, fast forward. How much is it? Yeah, measure. No, that's about two cups. No, that's not less two cups. I need it. Well, my containers are too small. So we're going to a stock pot. the bottom there. Don't want to miss out of any of sugar here. Now I'm going to pour the rest of this in. Okay, now it's a lighter color. What do you know? And I'm going to turn it up on medium heat. Now we go ahead and uh, cook it till we get to about 170 to 175 degrees. the mixture into the refrigerator and once it's cool enough not to form condensation on the lid cover and store for four to six hours until it reaches 40 degrees or below okay well mine finally made it about 173 degrees but I think I burned it There is specks in it. The you know the direction says it's an eight minute setup. Well, it lies. So now I'm gonna let this cool off, and uh, the wife wants to make two batches batches of this. So, and each batch makes six quarts, six quarts of ice cream. Uh, this ice cream, when it is done, it is very creamy, and when you freeze it, it's just like the stuff you buy in the store. You can add whatever flavoring you want. Um, one of these she's going to make into um, grape nut uh, ice cream, and the other one we're going to take and make into, uh, basically, it's, what's it called? Peppermint stick. So we're either going to get... Um, candy canes so we're going to get uh, star mints and crush them up and put them in there and tomorrow morning when we uh, go put it in the ice cream uh, maker we'll go ahead and 